Well, new at 10 controversy sparked at Shreveport City Council meeting regarding alcohol consumption during the upcoming Humor and Harmony Festival. And KSLA's Jasmine Franklin shares more about what unfolded inside Government Plaza this evening. Discussion surrounding alcohol consumption in downtown Shreveport during the upcoming Humor and Harmony Festival unfolded during Tuesday City Council meeting. So they won't be able to walk from those particular entities on into the district. Everything will be contained to where open container of district is. Resolution 109 proposed by Councilwoman Tabitha Taylor would have allowed an extension for the open container zone to be inclusive of stage works and the dome during the upcoming festival. Councilwoman Taylor says this type of resolution has been approved hundreds of times before. We've done amendments and ordinance to suspend the rules for alcohol 215 plus times since 2010 uh, with the city administration. So I thought with the number of people that were coming into the city of Shreveport that this would be a workable plan because we've done it before. However, majority of the city council did not agree with the resolution and in a five to two vote, the city council denied it. Um, we did approve other alcohol extended to this human harmony. So right now we want to make sure we're not put, getting too much alcohol involved and make sure that we can control the crowd and the crowd don't control us. Some council members believe approving this resolution would have created an extra economic impact in downtown Shreveport. And I just think that sometimes fear, okay, uh, false information appearing real. You know, let's see if it works. If it doesn't work, then we have a capable police department that can take care of whatever, and I know they could take care of four blocks. Since the resolution did not pass, this means, for example, if you get a drink at Stageworks or the Dome, you will have to finish it before walking outside in order to be in compliance with city ordinance. And it's important to note alcohol will still be sold at restaurants and bars in downtown Shreveport like normal during the festival. Reporting in studio, I'm Jasmine Franklin.